We humans are driven by the desire for knowledge. The ability to understand the workings and structure of our environment helped our species reach the highly developed point in our own history where we are today. Although humanity regularly produces new technological milestones, there are still countless realities that elude our knowledge almost entirely. While these mysteries of life on the one hand cause big question marks over the heads of experts, the fascination that emanates from these unsolved mysteries is equally undisputed. This topic becomes particularly exciting whenever we turn to a field that seems to exceed our tangible horizon. In the case of the universe, research is still in its infancy despite all the rockets sent into orbit and the successful moon landing in 1969. At present, we know only a tiny part of what is currently still hidden from our eyes in the infinite vastness of space. The question of how big the universe as a whole actually is, is a mystery that mankind has been dealing with for countless centuries. With today's contribution, we would like to present the current state of research on this topic. We will show you the current state of astronomical knowledge of our species, and we will also talk about why the answer to the question of the size of the universe is so difficult to come by. If you like our videos, please support us with a thumbs up, subscribe to Simply Space, and look forward to the videos that will be waiting for you in the future. Let's begin our journey through the vastness of the universe. What we can see of the universe. When we take a look at the sheer gigantic starry sky at night, Many of us realize how small we ourselves are in relation to the big picture. The thousands of twinkling stars in the firmament bear silent witness to the fact that our small home planet is only a tiny part of what is commonly known as the universe. Yet, even a quick glance at the canopy of the sky is enough to understand that the universe must be larger than anything we can even imagine. But can we scientifically understand how big the universe is in detail? This question has always been a central point in the field of cosmological research. It is even within the realm of possibility that this question can never be answered satisfactorily. However, this does not mean, of course, that experts would not try to answer it anyway. We currently know that the universe as we know it today was created about 13.8 billion years ago. The process known as the Big Bang, which essentially describes the formation of matter, space, and time from a previous singularity, is therefore considered the birth of our universe. In physical cosmology, the cosmic microwave background radiation plays a central role in the study of the earliest state of the universe. This is a type of radiation in the microwave range that was created in the course of the Big Bang and still flows through the infinite expanses of the galaxy today. With the help of various measurements, which examine the said radiation and put it in relation to different distances, Researchers succeeded in dating the approximate age of our universe. At the same time, this also means that we are currently able to look 13.8 billion light years into space from the Earth. If one wanted to visualize this circumstance, one could create a spherical drawing with the Earth as the center. The rest of the sphere now describes the area we can see from our blue home planet. In technical language, the universe visible to us is called the event horizon. In detail, the event horizon describes the spectrum of objects whose reflected light we can just about see from the Earth. However, those processes that take place behind this event horizon are currently completely invisible to our human eyes. Since we do not know exactly what is actually behind the observable universe, it is all the more difficult to answer the question of the overall size of the universe. The Expansion of the Universe if one considers the question of how big the universe is in its entirety, an essential fact cannot be ignored. As experts today now know, the universe is constantly expanding. While at the time of the Big Bang, an object was still about 13.8 billion light years away from the Earth, the distance between the celestial body in question and our home planet is now already 46 billion light years as a result of the expansion of space. This circumstance also means that in the future, we will be able to see objects in the firmament that are still hidden from our eyes today. At the same time, due to the expansion of the universe, 
some celestial bodies will disappear from our star charts in the future. Naturally, during these observations, we put our Earth in the center. This is simply due to the spatial circumstances, as we have no other choice than to mark our home planet as the central vantage point in our star charts. But at which geographical point our blue home planet is actually located within the constantly growing universe is impossible to answer today. The Measurement of the Universe As we mentioned at the beginning, international teams of experts regularly try to explore the entire dimensions of space despite all adversities. To do this, experts use a number of different methods that help researchers to explore the gigantic dimensions of the universe. Key research methods include certain measurements that investigate the radiation of the early universe. Using these radiation movements, scientists can determine different distances and try to quantify the dimensions of the universe. The oldest known light source that researchers have been able to identify in this way is 92 billion light years away from Earth. Conversely, however, this does not mean that the located object is actually the outermost component of the universe. The question of whether the universe ends somewhere is actually much more difficult to answer than many of us would at first assume. Basically, the further away an object is from our home planet, the longer it takes for the light reflected by it to reach our Earth. Some objects in the galaxy are at such a great distance from us that the light rays they emit sometimes take billions of years before we can see them from Earth. According to this, there are currently still countless light rays in the universe on their way to us, which have been traveling through the universe for billions of years, but have still not reached us. The question of the shape of the universe. To calculate the size of an object, it is essential to know the corresponding shape of the object. The actual shape of our universe is still an unresolved question within research, which has not yet been satisfactorily answered. While some scientists suspect that our universe is constructed like a self-contained sphere, which could be a part of a superordinate multiverse, other experts think that the universe is rather a flat space, which is also infinite. If one follows the first thesis, our universe would be a self-contained structure with an endpoint somewhere. So if our galaxy is indeed a finite construct, then at least theoretically, it would be possible to determine the dimensions of the universe mathematically provided the experts had the necessary data. However, if our universe is infinite, then the question of size is simply a point that cannot be answered. By definition, no size can be assigned to infinite objects because they have no boundary points that would allow a mathematical explanation. According to some statements of NASA, the universe is a flat construct that is infinitely large. However, our universe itself has a finite age and, as already mentioned, was created about 13.8 billion years ago. That's why it's only possible for us to investigate the time period between the Big Bang and today. An unanswerable question? Even if international teams of experts currently do not know how big the universe really is, researchers can say with certainty that the universe is an incredibly huge, possibly even infinite construct, which exceeds all of our horizons with its gigantic dimensions. The precise exploration of the universe is essentially a work that will involve countless generations of experts. And even though we will probably never know in our lifetime how huge the universe is in detail, this circumstance will not dampen our fascination for the exciting world of foreign stars and planets. What do you think about the true size of the universe? Do you think that the universe is a closed entity? or an infinitely large construct. Feel free to let us know your thoughts on this topic in the comments. Thanks a lot, and see you next time.